Oh, are you saying the water line crosses here? It crosses yeah. into the property? No, this is PG&E, I would imagine. Oh, okay. I would imagine this is PG&E. Because the sewer so, Oh, this is the water line. This, this is the... The sewer's right here. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. Let me think. Is there sewer on the street? No, there's no sewer on the street. The sewer goes this Oh, okay. That's um, why you have to go that way. Yeah. On oh, okay, so that's the green line right there. That's, that's the, your so that's your lateral. That that is your lateral. That is my lateral. Now I, I we don't. Have, <laughs> you have to have a grade one or grade A contractor to come out into the city street. Oh, okay, grade A, yeah. And so so basically, <laughs> so uh, do you know if they're they're requiring me to replace this line here? I do not know that. Oh, uh, okay. All I am is just a marking okay guy. Oh, uh, okay. All I'm doing is just doing my job. Because I think they said the upper lateral. The upper lateral would be from that point. And to your property. To the house, yes. okay. And so what is this called, you know? Lower lateral. Lower, that's called the lower lateral, okay. All right. And let's see. So do you know if the, if the water line actually, uh, whatever, the drinking water line actually crosses that? All I know is my water line is right here. It's my main water line oh, okay. is here. You see that green box there? Yeah. It ties off and goes to there. I do not know where it goes from that box out. I do not know where oh, it goes. Oh, but, but basically it comes down here and then goes into there and then it may go up or down or it may the go straight. The main water line runs right here, up and down. From here all the way down the street. Right. Ties into that street and goes different directions. Oh, okay. This one goes different directions here. There's the valve cluster there. Once you have a service tap on the water line that goes to that box right there. Okay. From that box into your property, I do not know where it goes. Right, right. I've seen it where it's gone in an inch and 45 and ran all the way back to the back end of the corner here. From all the way oh, back really? Over there. I've seen them go straight in. I've seen them come in and 45 all the way across. I've seen water lines and sewer lines do funky things. Okay. Outside on private property. That's why we don't mark. Okay. On private property. Because, uh, um, so this is uh you all you because I was thinking I would I would need to mark it from the inside but you're saying all we need to do is mark it from the outside. Yep. Because okay. right now, so this right here is when I said make a nail bracket. Yeah. This is telling me I need to know what's in here oh, okay. this way. Right. So if someone would mark, say it's like someone called a USA ticket for the intersection here, uh -huh. they would just mark the L shape here. Go L here. You go across and make another L shape. Then go on the other side and make another thing. And that's right. telling me, I want to know what's right here in this intersection. Okay. I need to know what's all in this intersection. All right. Now, if I come out and you go, I'm just replacing my sewer line in front of my address, that means I had have to mark everything from the front of your property all the way on the back side here, all the way down to the other side. Right, right. And that's why, hence, the white paint comes in saying, this is my proposed dig area. Okay. I want to know what's in this side. Okay. Yeah, I wasn't, uh... So see, see, I'm just a handyman here. So, and then the landlord asked me to call the the eight one one number. Yes. And so, uh, I, I I'm not sure if I'm gonna actually dig it or we're just gonna do the have a contractor plumbing contractor do it. So she just asked me to come out here and make sure that this is already done. But apparently, I'm just they have to, the contractor has to ask to to do this too. Contractor or now since you called it in, a contractor whoever you get to do the contract work will also call in the USA too. Uh, I have to. Okay. The reason why is because the responsibility would fall onto you. Now, if a contractor came in and started digging, right. that thing, he will get fined and you will get fined if they hit something. Like, say, if there's a main gas line, oh, a main okay. sewer line running yeah. through there, okay. and you called it in, and another and a subcontractor came in and started working under okay. your USA ticket, and they uh -huh. hit 